up everybody Jake here and I have something special that I want to talk to you guys with today sorry guys road comes first and it's special and that is my dildo and it's not just any dildo it's the Jake Orion or Oreo or Orion or whatever you want to call it special it's the six by nine or you could say nine by six nine inches long six inches around by girth I guess you would call it and there is tons and tons and tons of people who purchased this dildo I believe it was on sale for the holidays I'm pretty sure that flesh jack has sold at least a couple thousand of my dildos which is remarkable and all the people who tweet me and and show me and it, it's amazing it feels amazing not that my dicks in your ass but it feels amazing knowing that people really want it and people enjoy using it but today I'm gonna give you guys tips on how to use it properly and I'm gonna tell you a quick story before I give you those tips is before I was a cam model I have never used a dildo before ever and the only time only thing I would do is is put a finger in my butt while I was taking a shower you know that's that's about it so people ask you Jake have you used your dildo before yes I have used my dildo before and I enjoy using my dildo but I don't really do it on camera again if you do want to see me using my own dildo just to give you guys a little motivation coming from somebody who already used it I do sell the videos on my fan site which most of you guys know about if you don't Jake Orion xxx.com so for, for here's some tips on using the dildo and to use it properly I don't have one in hand with me I have it back in my um, office at my house but for some tips is number one be very 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 careful it takes time to get it in and especially if you were like me who never used a dildo before not that that was my first dildo I ever used but it takes time you need to rub and, and massage the butthole and I remember when I was a kid and I stuck something in my butt I'm like ah oh, it hurt like hell and then I and then I realized learning from the right people who do it a lot taught me how to do it properly so what you want to make sure is that you have a nice anal lube um, I personally use passion lube I got a big big thing of it for like really really cheap and I love it and it's it's been very good for me other lubes used to be too sticky dried out too fast too rough on the cock so I use this lube passion lube and you guys see it on my cam videos so what you want to do is make sure you cut your nails if you have nails and you finger your ass that is like one of the worst pains it's like sticking a knife in your ass and that's something you don't want to do so make sure your nails are cut put a little lube on your finger rub around your butthole rub just rub around and then after you rub around for a good minute or so actually put a finger in then once you're comfortable with one finger put in two fingers then once you're comfortable with two fingers work on three fingers and you might say well Jake there's a lot of fingers in my ass yes but this is what you need to tell your ass that listen buddy you're gonna have to open up something big's coming in okay something big is coming in you need to open up and spread so one finger two finger three finger work to four fingers and just like this just like that okay don't go like this just like that make four fingers I'm not telling you to fish your ass here or anything I'm just saying four fingers rub it rub it rub it uh, an accessory that you can buy, buy sorry that will warm you up for this dildo would be a nice plug so this is an other alternative and I'll get to what you can do with the plug right after this but after you do the four fingers and you're comfortable and your asshole feels like it's not pushing out everything and squeezing then you can use the dildo in one of two ways that I suggest one sitting with your legs up and put it in which is a little bit harder or two you could put the dildo on the ground it stinks that it doesn't have any suction cup or anything you can put the dildo on the ground and gently sit on it and work your way in so when you do get to the point where you do want to put it in you have to be very 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 slow it's not something you just throw in there and everything's good unless you're experienced and then maybe you can so 
you gotta work the tip in. And why you're putting it in your ass, make sure you're watching something that turns you on. Make sure you're watching something that turns you on that will allow your ass to open up. Hold on, guys. Make sure you're watching something that turns you on that will allow your ass to open up and say you're excited because when you're horny, your ass opens up. That's how it works. So your ass is opening up. While you're watching the porn, make sure you're masturbating. I prefer to use lube while I'm masturbating with a dildo. I'm actually getting turned on while I'm talking about this. And gently put it in slowly while masturbating while watching your porn. And it will go in. Let it take your time. Let it take time. Now, I'm not going to be talking about feces removal and bowels removal and enemas and stuff like that. That's on you guys to look that up and do your research about it. But I advise you, if you haven't used the bathroom today, make sure you use the bathroom before you use the toy. Make sure you use the bathroom before you use the toy. So that will allow you to get most of the dildo in your ass. You should be able to fit the whole thing in. I personally can fit the whole thing in if, you know, I'm an empty man. So if I'm empty, I fit the whole thing in and it feels great when something that deep is in you and you can get your prostate going. Um, okay, so that's getting the dildo in. You should be, you know, an eight and uh, an expert at it now. I'm just kidding. So now for a plug, I personally prefer glass plugs, which I have. So get a get a glass plug, and this is a step after you finger, like I told you, with the four fingers. One, two, three, and then four. Make sure you're comfortable. Okay, so with a glass plug, gently put in your butt and and leave it there. Go watch something, go masturbate, don't come. Leave it there, masturbate for, for five, ten minutes, and then after you take out that plug, you can then insert the dildo, and it's gonna be a hell of a lot easier for you guys hell of a lot easier so this was a quick update with the jake orion dildo and we're going to talk about the flesh jack maybe next time with you putting your dick in it and how that works and everything but the dildo it's such a great experience it's not too hard it's not too soft a lot of people say well is it the, the dildo smaller than your dick you know it might be a fraction off but it's it's very similar guys I'll tell you the process real quick because I have a few minutes. I went to Texas and I went to a room where they had the moldings done and everything. And I had to stay hard for a certain amount of time. It wasn't easy, guys. I can't be, you know, in front of people trying to get hard and everything. It just, it just didn't feel comfortable for me. But at the same time, you know, I did what I had to do. So they put the mold on my cock and I had to sit on my cock for about a minute. And then I was told to stay hard for a minute with it on my cock, which was really hard. And the first time I did it, it didn't come out right, and I had to redo it, and we got to, hold on guys, the cop there. We got to a point where it actually worked out. So, the dildo is a total of nine inches insertable, it's only seven, but that's because the balls are in the way, which doesn't happen if we had sex, my balls wouldn't be in the way, because my balls hang as low as fucking hell. So, those low hangers, so you know what I'm saying. So that wouldn't be a problem at all. So if you guys want to experience this, guys, get yourself a Jake Orion dildo and go have fun with it, guys. You will not regret it. I'm at the gym. It's time for me to go. I love you all. Take care.